Today is the day where Jacob Lawson will choose a violin to play from my father's collection of violins and we'll be recording the Cade theme song. The Cade Museum for Creativity and Invention is named after my father, Dr. Robert Cade. He's best known for leading the team that invented Gatorade in 1965 at the University of Florida. People think of him as a physician. He was a kidney doctor. But when I think of him, I also think of he was a poet, he was a musician, he grew roses, he restored cars. He truly was a modern version of the Renaissance man. My father started his first violin lessons at age seven. It was a part of his life. Until the very end, it was an animating principle. So music physically alters the structure of your brain and helps you form connections, which is behind critical thinking, learning how to think, learning how to solve problems. It's connecting neural networks within the brain and music solidifies those networks. Now we have a collection of 30 antique violins and cellos, string instruments, and we thought he spent a lifetime collecting these violins. We can either sell these or we can Put them into a collection and actually have it be used to transform our community. Creativity does not happen in a linear fashion. It's more of a spiral and it's always playing off of what came before but in a different way, in a different angle. And so to me the spiral of this building captures that essence of creativity and the inventive process. The Cade Museum is based on the Fibonacci sequence. It's a modern interpretation of this ancient classic. So the Fibonacci sequence is a sequence of numbers that each digit is added to the digit that comes before. But the amazing thing is, is when you divide Fibonacci numbers, you always get the same ratio of 1.618. And that is called the golden ratio, the divine proportion, and it has been associated with beauty since antiquity. So we put the Fibonacci sequence on a spiral. We connected ourselves to the best of the past, but we're also pointed to the future. The Cave Museum approached Hartwood Studios with the idea of exploring a collaboration. I asked, would it be possible to record a theme song incorporating the letters C-A-D-E into the song, and at the same time, could you throw in a couple of Fibonacci numbers? The recording of this theme song today by Jacob really brings the whole story full circle. It takes you through the emotional experience of discovery, invention, trial, and failure, the bittersweet nature of life, the victory, the sadness. It's all wrapped up into this one song.